Let's make lunch for my kids. Today we're doing a breakfast for lunch with mini pancakes and bacon. I cut the bacon before I cook them with scissors to fit perfectly into those trays. I am slicing up the green grapes. So here they are perfectly sliced. And I added some blackberries and some goldfish for their sides. Today I'm going to be using cute little yellow monkeys to decorate the food. And for the note, I'm writing, you are my moon and my sun and my star. I like to switch up my notes with song lyrics, jokes, and inspirational quotes for her as well. I'm gonna add some ketchup for her bacon and honey for her pancakes, and that's it. Let's make some lunch for my kids. Today, I'm starting out with some watermelon and cutting them into flower shapes. After, I'm gonna take a straw and poke a hole right in the middle of the flowers. If you have a boba straw on hand, it will probably be a better size because I'm gonna add a blueberry to the middle of them. I randomly thought of this idea before going to bed last night and I'm really happy with the way they turned out. They're super cute blueberry watermelon flowers. And I saw Justin Timberlake doing this. Um, he put a blueberry inside raspberries and I saw him eating it. There's a video out there if you Google it. Now I'm adding some rice and futakake rice seasoning and some sausages. They're basically like little smoky sausages, but I did get these at the Korean store, so they're a little bit bigger. I just fried them up really quick and added some animal pics. And now for her note, I'm writing, Hey baby girl, yay it's Friday. Please remember to wash your hands. Be safe. I love you. Let's make some lunch for my kids. Today I added quinoa to my white rice. Quinoa is high in fiber and protein, so super good for you. I made Korean short ribs called kalbi and added that with the rice. I'm slicing up some apples. I'm using a bunny shaped fruit cutter. Look how cute they are. I'm going to add those to the bento box. And then I barbecued up some corn on a skewer. They came out so cute and delicious. So I did four little skewers. I could probably eat a million of those myself. And I added a fortune cookie. For her note, I wrote radiate positivity. I know everything right now seems scary and uncertain, but I know that we will overcome this. Let's make some lunch for my kids. Today I'm making blackened salmon Caesar salad. I'm starting off by cutting up some romaine lettuce, adding Caesar dressing to it and mixing that well. I'm gonna add the lettuce onto the bento box and then taking the blackened salmon and adding that right on top. It came out super juicy and yummy. I'm slicing up some tomatoes to add to the salad and doing the same with a couple of lemons. Can't have any salmon or Caesar salad without the lemons, so that is a must have. I'm topping it off with some Parmesan cheese and our salad is complete. Now I'm adding a cutie orange with our daisy food pick, some Cool Ranch corn nuts, and a Spongebob Krabby Patty gummy. And for our note, I'm writing, Dear Math, grow up and solve your own problems. This is how I feel about math. I hate it. Let's make some lunch for my kids. Today I'm making caprese salad bites. I'm using heirloom tomatoes and chopping that up into cubes and doing the same with a mozzarella cheese ball. I'm adding the tomato first onto a toothpick and then adding some fresh basil and topping it off with the cheese. You can also use baby cherry tomatoes and also baby mozzarella balls. I'm sprinkling a little salt and pepper, drizzling some balsamic vinegar on top and some olive oil. You can always reduce the balsamic vinegar to make it a little bit thicker on a pan. I'm adding some fries for her side, some watermelon sour gummies, and some mandarin oranges. For the note, I'm quoting a song by The Plain White Tees. There's only one thing to do, three words for you. I love you. 